What's up guys, Drug Free Dave here, and welcome to 3D for Beginners with Nomad Sculpt Part 2. So if you haven't already taken my original 3D for Beginners class, then take that one. That way you can get familiar with Nomad Sculpt because I go through all the tools and everything else. This class, we're gonna go a little bit further. I drew this blueberry in Procreate, and that's the beautiful thing about Nomad Sculpt and about 3D, is that you can take all your drawings, all your characters, whatever you want, and you can turn it into 3D. And let me tell you, it's addicting. I'm kind of obsessed with the app. It's just opened up a whole new world, and I've been just sculpting and just 3D modeling. And I'm gonna be honest with you, two years ago, I wouldn't have imagined that I would be getting into 3D, that I would be doing 3D art. Artists nowadays, like, we have to evolve. He is evolving. And I'm really glad Nomad came along at the right time and it will just change the way that you view your art. It will help you improve your 2D art. And there's just a lot of benefits to this. Expand your knowledge and expand, expand, expand. I don't know, I don't even know what expanding is, but we're gonna expand this blueberry into a nice, beautiful 3D character in this class. And one more thing, if the only thing stopping you is thinking that you won't be able to learn a new application, crazy 3D, super complicated application, it is complicated, but we're gonna go one step at a time. And I've only been doing this for about a year. A year. I started March in 2021 with Nomad Sculpt, with 3D. If I can do it, you can do it, and I'm gonna help you every step along the way in this class. Let's get to it. Let's move to the next video, the class project.